taking your tamoxifen. When Monica Lovins and her doctor discussed how they would fight her breast cancer, they had a plan of attack. Dr. Riceberg encouraged me to have chemotherapy first, shrink the tumors as much as possible, and after that, then do uh, surgical interventions. It was a lot for this Howard County mom to go through, but Monica is a nurse practitioner and knew it wouldn't be easy. Four years after her diagnosis, she says one thing is certain. Once you've had one episode of breast cancer, you don't want to have another episode of breast cancer. Mercy Medical Center oncologist Dr. David Reisberg doesn't want to see breast cancer come back, and oftentimes it does. He says tamoxifen is an option for his patients. Years down the road, the original cancer might be gone, but there's a new cancer in another portion of the same breast or in the other breast which could develop, and this lowers that by half. A recent study shows that the longer a patient takes the estrogen blocking medication, the better. Instead of five years, patients like Monica take it for 10. But part of cancer survivorship is really committing to the therapy from the beginning with a good plan right straight through those five and 10 years after. Monica says she feels great and wants to make sure it stays that way.